these are some Dinar Guru updates, starting off with Mark Z via PDK. I still hear, continue to hear phenomenal hopes from bankers for the coming days or weeks. All right, we've got Deep Woods talking about the float again, says that's what's coming, or these guys wouldn't be putting their two cents in. Some of what they say is true, some not. Even Saleh commenting on not knowing where it will end is a load of crap. The CBI can start, stop, change, maneuver the rate any way they like at any time. Of course, they can do whatever they want. They're a sovereign country again, pretending like they have no control. Frank 26, Iraq Boots on the Ground Report Firefly International Development Bank opens an ordeal. Frank says, notice how they're preparing your banks in many ways to receive the new exchange rate when Sadani releases it. They talk to you about the float, the basket, the lower notes, old lower notes, your history. Now they're going to tell you Iraqi citizens about your banks. They are educating you on the many services that your banks will be offering. Uh, you once this exchange is released. Mark Z via PDK community comments has got an email from a dinar dealer offering 825 for a million dinar buyback. I think that's a good sign because they can't get, Mark Z says, I think because they can't get any out of Iraq, Iraq is limiting it. So they're trying to get dinar from you. This is great news for us. Lastly, I've got Paulette who says Iraq's WTO Ascension package will likely not be submitted for adoption until MC14, which will be held in early 2026. It clearly was not submitted for adoption MC13. I anticipate that by then we really won't care.